If you love French Bulldogs, you're not alone. They've increased in popularity by a staggering 1,000% in the last 10 years. And their famous owners include Hugh Jackman, Dwayne The Rock Johnson, Hilary Duff, Lady Gaga, Reese Witherspoon, and so many more. Now, despite their name, they didn't actually originate in France. They came from a line of small, miniature, English Bulldogs. They did, though, first find fame in the boudoirs and brothels of Paris in the 1890s. It was felt that their cute, friendly faces were a great icebreaker to encourage patrons into these establishments. Now, did you know that French Bulldogs can't actually swim? It may be that they're able to tread water for a very short period of time, but they are not water dogs by any stretch of the imagination. Their short nose, their fat neck, their squat body and little legs mean that they're just very front heavy and they just can't generate the power needed to keep their head above the water for any length of time. And more often than not, they actually just sink like a stone. So you need to be super careful if your French Bulldog is anywhere near water. And if they do have the aspiration of being a water dog, then get them a little life jacket. Unfortunately, French Bulldogs are prone to a huge number of different medical conditions due to their conformation, their character, how they look. They struggle even just to breathe, suf suffering from something called brachycephalic obstructive airway syndrome, where their noses and their throats are just super narrow. Their bulging eyes make them more likely to develop ulcers and other eye problems. They have a higher risk of brain disease and spinal disease, slip discs and paralysis. They get ear problems, they get skin disease and suffer from allergies. And then tied into all this, they actually have the shortest life expectancy of any breed of dog, with a recent study showing that that was just 4.5 years compared to the average of 11.2 years across all dog breeds. And as well as this short life expectancy, they actually struggle to come into the world in the first place. Very often French Bulldogs have to be artificially inseminated. They actually can't mate properly. And then when they do become pregnant, the risk of suffering something called a dystochia, which is having problems giving birth, is 16 times higher than the average dog breed. And of those that do struggle to give birth, about 70% need caesarean sections. Now, despite all of these health problems, they're loyal, they're super friendly, they're great with children, and they're actually much less likely to suffer from behavioral problems like destructive behavior, aggression, barking. They really are fantastic companions. And with the right breeding, they absolutely can live full and healthy lives. And if you want to learn more about breeding for health rather than looks, you need to check out this video linked on screen. So click on there and I'll see you in the next video. But until then, I'm veterinarian Dr. Alex. This is Our Pets Health, because they're family.